my dear students here i am the screen i am having this topic which has been asked in 2021 examination the topic is for the essay paper 2021 essay paper you know that essay paper that is carrying 250 marks you need to write two essays each essay in almost 1000 to 1000 to 1200 words and this is having 125 marks each this is a essay from the section a from the section a out of four you have to choose one and from section b you have to choose one ये ऐसे है जो सेकेंड नंबर टॉपिक है 2021 के एग्जामिनेशन में पूछा गया है कि आपके आपकी मेरे बारे में धारणा योर परसेप्शन ऑफ मी हाउ डू यू परसीव मी आपकी सोच दर्शाती है इज ए रिफ्लेक्शन ऑफ यू वट यू थिंक अबाउट मी वट इज योर रिफ्लेक्शन ऑफ योर सेल्फ दैट यू सी इन माई सेल्फ देखिए दिस इज द फर्स्ट पार्ट एंड सेकेंड पार्ट आपके प्रति मेरी प्रतिक्रिया हाउ डू आई रिएक्ट अबाउट यू माई रिएक्शन टू यू इज एन अवेयरनेस संस्कार है अवेयरनेस ऑफ my dear students i am trying to use the bilingual method because what i understand that in upsc most of the students from the north india they do know hindi whether they are english medium or not and uh, even the hindi medium students understand english the serious civil service aspirant which are going to appear in the mains they understand english and in the essay paper ideas are the means of communication ideas are important or idea language neutral hota hai ideas are language neutral to main iske bare mein ek idea ki baat karta hu idea to kahin se bhi aata hai lekin aapki mere bare mein dharna your perception of me is a reflection of you and my reaction to you is an awareness of me do part mein isko aap dekhiye how do you perceive me आपके मेरे बारे में क्या सोच है आप मुझे कैसा समझते हो हाउ डू यू परसीव मी हाउ डू यू अंडरस्टैंड मी वॉट यू थिंक अबाउट मी इज इन फैक्ट योर इमेज वॉट यू हैव फॉर्म्ड अबाउट योर सेल्फ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग दिस पार्ट के लिए एक रामायण के एक प्रसंग को मैं बात करूंगा माई मेथड ऑफ एक्सप्रेसिंग इज थ्रू शर्ट शॉर्ट शॉर्ट स्टोरेज स्वयंबर का सीन है और लक्ष्मण और राम दोनों राजकुमार विश्वामित्र मुनि के साथ स्वयंबर में पहुंचते हैं वहां बहुत सारे राजा हैं रानिया देख रही है झरोखे से दे ऑल आर वॉचिंग एंड देडनली नोटिस दैट सम बडी हेज कम यंग लड़के राम और लक्ष्मण ऋषि के साथ आए हैं विश्वामित्र का बड़ा रेपुटेशन है जनक के दरबार में हाउ एवरीबडी परसीव राम गोस्वामी तुलसीदास इस प्रसंग को बड़े अच्छे से लिखते हैं ये बताते हैं कि जो कुटिल राजा है जो वहां अच्छा वेशभूषा पहन के आए हुए हैं उनको राम में जो है एक बड़ा खतरा महसूस होता है जो साधु संत है उनको लगता है विष्णु के स्वरूप आ गए राजा जनक को बड़ा ज्ञानी दिखाई देता है जो रानिया है उनमें एक बड़ा सुंदर छवि दिखाई देता है जैसे कि मेरा अपना बच्चा है और वहां जो लड़कियां हैं जो राजकुमारियां हैं उनके मन में एक आता है कि कितना मनोहारी छवि है हाउ ब्यूटिफुल टी या ठीक जाकी रही भावना जैसी प्रभु मूर्त देखी तिन तैसी को समय तुलसीदास लिखती है 
they perceive ram as the feeling they are having in themselves aapki mere bare mein dharna aap aapki soch ko darshati hai your perception of me is a reflection of you देखिए ऐसे में मैं तीन पार्ट में बहुत समझाने की कोशिश करता हूँ फर्स्ट इज द अंडरस्टैंडिंग पार्ट इफ यू अंडरस्टैंड द टॉपिक दैट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट दैट्स वाई हैव यूज दिस एनेक्टोर दिस स्टोरी कॉन्टेक्स्ट में बता रहा हूँ ये आज के कॉन्टेक्स्ट में सिविल सर्विस का कॉन्टेक्स्ट में ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड लाइक गांधी गांधी फॉर द पीपल who were sacrificing their life for the nation the idealist the non violent they consider in gandhi as their role model gandhi unke liye just near to god they see them in themselves the ideal image from all over the world even they were not from india they come to meet gandhi they got much impressed A Japanese monk went to meet Gandhi. They found that he is a great sannyasi, great monk. There was one Paramahans Yogananda who was a great monk at that time, very famous in USA. He came and met him. He found that yeah, he is a karma yogi. But at the same time, there were certain fanatics or certain very fundamentalist type. whether they were in the muslim league or hindu fundamentalist they were considering gandhi that is a by god the churchill he was considering him as a naked fakir and he was considering that he got allied to the axis power 1942 he was thinking that he is a naked fakir he was considering him that he is against the capitalist forces when gandhi was assassinated somebody was thinking that he is uh, against the ideology of certain sections of the people try to understand people perceive gandhi in their own way but what was gandhi if you analyze it critically and if you analyze it in the proper perspective we understand that what was he but still you are finding there are certain sections of the people who are in and in projecting gandhi in a different way so understanding part context part hum samajh gaye hain these two are very important now my reaction to you is an awareness of me my reaction to you here the word the key word is reaction what is reaction really Re this word i am telling that the pratikriya this word upsc i chosen definitely from potashes is telling my reaction to you for the wise man it is not the reaction for the wise man it is the response a response response when i am talking that response then i am talking about emotional intelligence here comes the daniel goleman which we have studied in our ethics and integrity in context i am telling that this quotation is having much more overbearing much more connections with the ethics ethics paper se kafi iska judav emotional intelligence self awareness if i am aware about myself if i am aware about me if i have discovered myself in so many ways then i will respond to a particular situation in a different way with a story i am telling that buddha when he was in the sangha perhaps in venu one or shravati somewhere the story is there daily in the evening he was giving the discourse there were certain sections of the people who were ritualistic one of the brahmins one came to him he started abusing buddha he started abusing that he is a by god he is having double standard 
whatever is preaching is nonsense it is nonsensical buddha was smiling and he was having compassion towards that person that what he is speaking in fact he was understanding that this person is ignorant he has not seen the real happiness in his rituals if he would be happy person he would have thought in a different way he need knowledge he need wisdom buddha was interpreting in that way when the crucifixion of jesus christ was there he was telling oh my lord these people are so ignorant Have mercy over them, because Christ was merciful. That's why that thing was coming in his mind. My response towards you, my reaction towards you, it is my sense car, my own upbringing, my own awareness. I think that the understanding and certain examples, these things are becoming clear to you. so i very natural that this two or three paragraphs if you try to make the things clear by giving certain anecdote certain example certain story the examiner will get impressed from this exercise only now come to the next level of thinking this is one level of thinking now come to the next level of thinking in the entire cosmos there is divine consciousness in fact the person who is wise they consider in each and everything the creations of the almighty for him kan kan me bhagwan kan kan me shiv kan kan me truth they find the truth everywhere the bond bonds them with everything and when they are bonding is so strong the people is all compassionate so what the thing which stops a person to not get that eternal bliss i am talking the word eternal bliss eternal bliss the bliss word means ultimate happiness permanent ki pra place what is the things that is the self observant behavior self observant apne aap mein khoya hua vyakti not observant it is absorbent if he self observant my struggle has to be there to become from the self absorbent to self observant if you discover our self and we know who i am then i am in my purest form nothing but in the state of bliss in the state of happiness then we will find happiness everywhere and a very happy person is always very merciful that's why in al fatima in quran the first word o benevolent Oh, merciful! Show me the straight path. That was the first line of the Quran. Al Fatima. My dear friends, we just see all these pictures goes towards that thing only. That they are one. They wish to give you ultimate happiness. In fact, in this world also, if you find that virtue and vice, always virtue is more. Vice are less. in any society if you find that how much kindness that society is having and how much cruelty that society is having if you try to note it down each and every kind gesture and the i mean cruel gesture you will find that kind gesture is much more that's why the world is such a beautiful place because in genesis it is written that all are the embodiment of God. God has created man in the image of Himself. What the image He was having? Oh, all benevolent, 
all dominion, all powerful, that embodiment here. So that is the next level of thinking. Now come to the second, this level, contemporary. Contemporary. In the coins of the world, there is much cacophonous world. Everybody is talking so many things. But there are certain people who aspire and who strive to march for ultimate peace in the world. For them, peace is the biggest mission. They always want orderliness in the society. They always tell that this thing is good for you. Even if they are finding that some unorderliness is there, they go for it. Because they believe in change. Because they perceive that change is possible. That's why I am finding that an 18 year old girl, she propagates for the environment and she becomes environmentalist. A girl from a Muslim country, that Afghanistan, Malala, she has gone all the way to spread hope that yes, girl child should be taught. There was a young person from Vivekanand, he has gone all the way to Chicago to show that yes, what are the wisdom from the East? Because the things that change can be possible. Even in the person in the West, the materialist, but they can understand my language because if they perceive that people all over are alike. Har jaga log ek tarhe. So I think that with this much of the thinking process, if you try to analyze this subject, my dear students, your essay will be superb. And why will you not get that good marks? Because the reflection of you has come on the piece of paper. And the teacher when he is examining, when he evaluating, if he is having a coffee cup with him, his coffee will become thanda. He will so much engross that he will start reading your essay. Then you are getting 150 plus marks. Be original, write, idea rules the world. Ideas are more powerful. Subse important ideas. So go for it. I am very sure that with these one servants, now you are motivated enough to write. Write, write, write. Practice, practice, practice. And you will be the winner. Thank you, my dearest.